We might go live in the middle of it. We might go live in the middle of it. So, I've been hearing amazing things about this episode. Literally amazing things. So, I do what I do best. I react to amazing things. <laughs> okay. Uh, One Piece episode 1062. We're not going to waste any time. Let's just get to it. Chit to it. Hey, everyone. Brago here. And today I want to talk about something that hits close to home for many of us. We all know that feeling when unexpected expenses pop up and you're left scrambling to make ends meet before your next paycheck. It can be really stressful. Picture this. You have an unexpected medical expense or get into a fender bender, but you don't have the money to cover it right away. It happens to the best of us, right? That's where Dave comes in. Dave is the banking app that can help you get up to $500 instantly with extra cash. And the best part, no interest, no late fees or credit check. Imagine having more money in your pocket to fill up your tank, finally get your car repaired or catch up on bills. Dave gives you the financial relief you need without having to wait for your next paycheck. I am not the only one who thinks Dave is a game changer though. Millions of people have already downloaded the Dave app and experienced the peace of mind that comes with extra cash. So if you're in a pinch and need that extra help, download Dave today and think of it as a helping hand from future you. To get started, just go to dave.com BDA and sign up for an extra cash account. You could get up to $500 instantly that's dave.com slash bda and for terms and conditions check out dave.com slash legal this year let's face unexpected expenses head on and take control of our finances dave is here to help you start the new year off on the right foot banking services provided by evolve member fdic it's uh i guess i, I don't know what's what, what's coming uh this is one of the few episodes that i have been told to mute Imagine that. Imagine that. All right. Like I said, I expect great things. How how how, how is being gassed? Yeah. Okay. Chichue. Okay. This is where we ended off last time, right? With Ifrit. This is happened last time. You know what I'm saying? Coke and kick. I mean, this combination is just it's just lovely. It's beautiful. It's diabolical. What? 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 Diabolical. It is. It is superb. It is enchanté. A bluff bust. Apparently, Zoro topped this. Like I said, we got the recap episode because they needed time. They weren't done. So, okay. Okay. You do it. <laughs> okay. What promise have you made, brother? <laughs> yo, he, hey, he talking his smack right now, bro. He's saying, yo, as long as we're around, sorry, brother. Sorry. Oh, my God. Okay, that was an interesting exchange. What a way to kick it off. My constitution is unusual. You transformed quick. You're that weak, but you want to be a king? It ain't working, bruh. King of monster, I ain't gonna lie. And because of his speed, he's not letting Zoro regroup, right? It's not like he's unbreakable, but it's pretty damn close, yeah? This is how you amplify your fight. Ooh, sassy! Get sassy then! Look at that Kaka's hockey dripping! Dripping! Are they both got sent flying back? Who is that? Is that King? Is that what King looks like under the mask? Ooh! Zoe's like, I got one! All this for a drop of blood? Yo, why? <laughs> Luton. Yo! Yo, why yo, why do these strong dudes always get mad when you gas them, right? Katakuri is the same. <laughs> they get mad and it's like go off go after their subordinates. Yo, so we're talking to smack now. Beautiful ass nigga. True. That's true. That's true. That's pretty true. That's pretty true. I mean That's true. <laughs> you do, you, hey King, you messed up. You just gave Zora a little power bump. Yo, that little that little bang when he's in his form is so cute. Damn. It, it was a previous shot in the last episode where Zoro attacked King and his feet went under. Getting a little bloody, brother. That's none of my business. And I'm gonna say, I, I came, you gotta pay what you owe. All right, I came back to get it. That's on some category. You're no longer not on my level type stuff. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Okay. What are we doing? What are we doing? Hmm. 
We get flashback time. Yes, flashback time. I wonder how long it's going to be. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to lie. I like young Kaido's swag. He looks like Eustace a little bit. Yo, Kaido was watching him. He's like, I'm a durability master. You seem to be pretty good at it. Kaido's like, I respect durability, bro. I like the sentimental. Yo, look at that. Just one swing. <laughs> the thing is, he's saying, can you change the world? That's the interesting question, right? Because a lot of times, based on how the world is, right, you would assume he's asking, can you change the world for the better? Um, because right now the world is not great. Considering that he's being used as a guinea pig, that's the implication. But I don't think that those are Kaido's plans. So, yeah. It's nothing to him. And this is longer than the actual, I mean, obviously it's a manga. Ooh. He's like, yo, you kind of decent. Oh, that's clean. That's clean. That's clean. Ooh. What's your name? I love that. Oh, da, 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 da. That's, 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 that's closer to Caesar than Kaido. I'm not going to lie, y'all. A part of me now wants a Kaido and King. I don't know. Maybe short form four episode special. Like just seeing what they went through. I know we're going to get most uh, how can i say this i know we're gonna get more of kaido's backstory when the rock's story comes about not too much but there's gonna be things left out obviously because you can't just specifically focus on kaido you have too many people to focus on give us a four four episode special give us that that'd be nice i feel like they're about to get saucy bro yeah i think king's aoe is this is beautiful. It's actually disgusting. It was Zoro just like maneuvering. And the thing is, King has mobility. He has insane strength. He has durability. On paper, he should easily be the strongest commander. And Zoro's taking that. <sighs> Ooh, it's a battle of auras, baby. Oh my gosh. It'd be cool if he just popped up behind him like, I, I don't even know what that means. <laughs> I am speechless. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what have we done? What have we done to deserve this? My, one of my favorite attacks right here. One of my favorite attacks right here. I, you just gotta shut up and just enjoy this. It, it, it's starting to work. King is a monster. Oh my god. This is movie quality, y'all. This is movie quality. Now the animators are just showing off. Yo, King has Yonko... Caliber AO. <laughs> Yo, I, I'm. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yo, he cut his wing off. You are biologically not capable of beating me? Yeah. Yo. Okay, okay, okay. I guess One Piece. This might be the best. Okay. All right. Let me, let me. Yo, a yo, after this episode... I don't know how we don't view King as the strongest right hand. If we go, if we use the anime to kind of that, okay, I, I, I'm being a bit facetious because we don't use the anime necessarily to, to use scale, etc. But based on what Dragon Damnation and Imperial Flaming Dragon, whatever the hell, I'm sorry, bro. Listen, that is Yonko caliber. AOE, Yonko caliber destruction. In my mind, Albert feels like a couple steps away. All right, let me not go that far. But the fact that Zoro overcame this and the difference between the two, Zoro and Sanji and King and Queen, I don't want to spur this on. But I, based on the anime episodes, 
I, this this is not how fights work, right? It's not because you beat this guy and this guy's stronger than this guy. That means he's stronger than this guy. But how they portray both fights, it does not seem like Queen is particularly close to King. And it does not seem like Sanji is particularly close to Zoro. I know they fight differently. I'm not saying it's going to be like the same way, but oh. All right, let me make let me make this clear right freaking now. No right hand is beating Zoro. Kid and Law ain't beating Zoro. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, uh, at this point, literally at this point, the only people that are contesting with Zoro, obviously the Yonko, obviously the Admirals, but the in between Sabo, Ben Beckman, um, obviously Luffy is stronger than Zoro. Sabo, Ben Beckman, those. Well, I said no right hand is beating Zoro, and I stand on that. I got Zoro over Ben Beckman. Um, should you get him out of here? Get him out of here. Whatever trick or gimmick that he has, he's not beating Zoro. Get him out. Um, who's next? Who's next? Who we got in that in between? It was a Sabo, Ben Beckman. I don't know. That's about it. That's about it. Okay, we can get to the old man trio with Garp, Sengoku, and Rayleigh. Okay, fair, 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 fair. But if three men walk into a bar, one is Garp, one is Zoro, one is Sengoku, the man that I'm betting on is Zoro walking out of there. I'm sorry. We are gone. All right, maybe a little bit of recency bias. <laughs> let me chill, 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 Look at where he is, yo. And he does it again, but this is way more powerful. There's always a goal. There's always a goal. I give up. I give up. I give up. I give up. Genuinely, genuinely, if they gave next episode a recap of just Sanji and Chopper watching Zoro in that final fight, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. So was the go. So was the go. So was the go. So was the go. I'm about to go watch the game by myself. I the greatest ever. The great.